Hey guys, Boston, Massachusetts is checking in. So we're about to talk about it, two things. A shooting that occurred in the Bronx, New York, okay, of 10 people, where two masked men got off of a scooter and started shooting at a group of people that was at the barbershop and also a group of people that was attending a party. So the ages range from 19 to 72 years old. And these men, are, three of the men were identified as gang members and the other were just basically party attendees okay so i said well that's weird you know what i mean because that don't really happen i don't think too much since the pandemic there haven't been no a lot of shootings in the hood since the pandemic which is a good thing there has been shootings but it hasn't been as high as it normally would be especially in my hood and everything okay um my neighborhood so I said, that's weird. I said, that sounds like a police hit to me. And the reason I said that, because I don't know. It just was, a, it sounded weird. Like, what would be the odds of that? That this group of people that probably always socialize there, okay? Like, this is not a new, new thing for them. Like a one-time event. So I was like, what would be... Excuse me, guys. I said, what would be the odds of that? Then it was like how the police were acting as well. You know? But this was 10 hours ago. You could check out the story. Uh, you could Google it for more information. I'm just going to bring you the headline and tell you what's happening. But my opinion as a viewer in my comment that I left. That was that. And the second thing is that South Talk is reporting that DJ Villa stole, went and registered and copyrighted the lyrics to Mama's Cooking and the Get Along, Go Along Gang and probably Captain Jack too. Now, people were getting copyright strikes on their channel for playing the music, but he said to challenge the copyright strike and let them know that you got permission you was granted permission from original producer which is his name is Maurice Spears okay and the person who is going around giving everyone the copyright strikes on the channel for playing Mama's Cooking and Go Along Gang Get Along Gang songs is DJ Perry Vila who went and registered the work of Maurice Spears at the copyright office. So he wasn't the owner of it. He stole that man's work. Let's just call it what it is. Another black man. Okay? Another black man. Now, See, you got people that is that are against you that you can see that's up close and personal and direct people who you just chill out with all the time, you know, or interact with. And then you got those ones behind the scenes doing more wicked stuff. Like stealing your work, your intellectual property, and claiming it as their own. And for crying out loud, he's a DJ. He is a DJ. And believe me, this stuff happens all the time because the celebrities, or any person, but it's mostly people in the music industry who do this type of stuff. Sometimes they don't have anything to do. They watch videos just like all of us. They don't like they don't they can't like or anything like that because if it, it'll show the, what they like you understand they like the videos if you go like about to their pages and all of that shit you understand but yeah sometimes they take your work and they steal it that's why you have to trademark 
you have to trademark your work, trademark your name, trademark your brand. Believe it or not, you being a content creator, you too have a brand now, you know? And uh, all it takes is one video and then boom, whatever, and then people want to know who you are. You just never know today, okay? So the purpose of this conversation is to take the necessary steps to protect your property rights, whether it be personal, intellectual, or real estate property. If it belongs to you, you need to make sure that you have your I's dotted and your T's crossed as far as who you would like to be your beneficiary in case anything happens to you. And I feel like when you own intellectual property like your YouTube channel brand, you know, that's going to be like going on and on and on and on forever and ever and ever. That's the, the, the gift that keeps giving. You understand all it takes is for you to something big to pop off with you or you even like a, you're deaf you know how it is we don't give people their flowers when they're here but we damn sure give it to them when they're dead when they can't hear it when they can't say thank you when they can't shed a tear for your love when they just can't so that's how it is you know <sighs> i'm going on my walk guys then i got some work to do today's a house day Monday, I'm working from home. So, like, share, subscribe to my video. I will talk to you later. Thank you.